Hello everyone. Two to three. Four nine eight five. Million cases worldwide. Meaning that by the time you see this, we will have hit 54 million cases worldwide. We hit a new record yesterday. 653,000 new cases yesterday. And here we got Thanksgiving in less than two weeks where 58% of Americans say they're going to travel. Well, let me tell you what. Some governors are putting tighter restrictions that will ban all Thanksgiving celebrations. The Mesa Thanksgiving Parade it's already only going to be one block. In uh, 2019, it was 25. And with all the performance, musical performances and stuff, that's a three-hour show. Now it's going to be down to an hour. Or even a half hour. Yes, it's only a block. And a block is seven... Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. They're going to drag it out with the Broadway musicals. That's only going to be like an hour. Mm-hmm. What else? Oh, yeah, these tighter restrictions for close schools and all those things. Iota's going to make landfall early next week. I don't know what happened to Theta. I don't know what happened to Theta. But Iota is going to make landfall early, early next week. Oh yeah, Keegan Michael Key made a new Christmas movie. Cried over uh how hard the children of that movie worked. I don't know. I don't know what what Keegan goes through in his daily life, but Oh yeah. CBS drama series Bull back next Monday. Uh I believe NCIS franchise, uh, NCIS is supposed to be back next Tuesday, the 17th. Uh, in its 18th season, Bulls only in its fifth. Uh, what else? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, everybody loves Raven star, Patricia Heaton. She's hanging out with nuns. She moved to Nashville. Yes. Yes. Rebidis, you got the past uh, Labor Day parties Ray Romano threw, obviously. Couldn't throw one this year, but you know. You know. <sighs> what else? What? What else? Oh, yeah. North Carolina went to Trump. I, I still don't know. Uh, subsources are still saying that. Georgia hasn't called Biden yet, but I, I don't know. There's recounts all over, and yeah, we, we still don't know. We do know that Biden and his team are not receiving those central intelligence briefings or literally anything else for the transition. Uh, what else? What? else I don't know I don't know some uh, American soldiers got in a plane crash in Egypt six of them died police officers or something dead yeah yeah uh that's all I can remember that's all I can remember um I'm in the woods this Saturday. Uh, there's a moss branch. Although, because I was back out here in the spring, back when it was locked down. Although I may have to take tighter restrictions because, you know, it is getting colder. I'm filming this in 35 degree weather. If it gets below freezing and I have to film outside, you're going to see me in a thicker coat rather than this uh, rather thin jacket. Uh, I'm going to go out here a little more. I'm not going to touch any trees because we are not in the same situation that now that we were in the spring.
life has changed since uh, early May. So I'm not gonna touch any of these trees. Yeah, you saw me get on the ground, but that was that was like eight days ago. COVID-19 has developed in the past week. It has gotten way worse. And now that uh, we could be locking down again, I'm just not gonna touch anything out here, really. Whoop. Nah. nah. You know, I always bite my nails so they're all short. I'm trying to make them longer. So, I gotta stop biting them. Uh, yeah, I tried to step up this uh, big curly branch, but it just backfires. Uh, let me tuck you up here a little bit. You know, and also back in the spring, I didn't have a tripod, but now I do, so. Yeah, there's a, there's a hay pile that's been developing over the past few years. Um, let's show that pot holder. Plant holder. It's not a pot holder, it's not big enough to hold all those big plant pots, um, flower pots, but you know. <sighs> yeah. yeah, it means I'm not gonna even bother getting through there. Not at the moment, because the current si COVID situation way worse than it was in the spring. You know, in the spring, I was uh, panicking over five million cases. Now, 55 will be a reality here in the next few days. Uh, Cause it's just gonna keep rising. You know, the Italians, they uh, let their guard down, so they're they're having a big COVID problem over there. Saw some footage of a uh, recently passed away due to COVID uh, person was alive two to three minutes before that footage was taken, and then they just passed away. Uh, yeah, it's the reality everywhere. We're, there's like over 1.3 million deaths worldwide. Not even over. And deaths are rising uh, rapidly too. They're worse than they were in the spring. So, yeah. Yeah, anyway, I'm gonna I'm walk back up here. Subscribe to my channel. I have got to go now, bye.